Did you know that there are some settings that can make you better in Farlight 84? Let's start with Aim Assist. Keeping Aim Assist on will help you a lot while taking fights. Let me show you how. So as you can see, I am not moving my aim, but my aim is automatically going towards the enemy. But if I will keep aim assist off, then the aim will no longer be automatically moved towards the enemy. As you can see, my aim is not going towards the enemy. If you go for a side-by-side -side comparison, you will clearly see the difference. So if you are new to this game, then make sure to turn this setting on. The second settings is for those players who have low-end device. You have to make sure that your field of view is not more than 80. Otherwise, it will cause lag as it is clearly written. So make sure to keep it at 80 for better gaming experience. The next important setting for you guys will be to turn off auto-fire weapons. By turning on this setting, what exactly will happen that you will fire automatically whenever you will aim on enemy which is not so good while playing tournament matches and can lead you to easy death. As you can see, I am not using my fire button, but whenever I am aiming on opponent, the fire will automatically start. So make sure to turn this setting off if you want to be better at this game. The next settings that need to be turned on is quick switch scope button. If you will turn off this sensitivity, you will not be able to see the quick scope button and you will have to open your bag in order to change scope, which will take some extra time. So in order to save time, make sure to turn this setting on. As you can see now, I can directly change the scope with quick scope button. And if you guys want to copy all of my settings then, this is the settings that I am currently using. So that was it from today's video, see you guys in the next video.